Hi guys, we will solve the lab exploiting HTTP request smuggling to bypass front end security controls. The level of this lab is practitioner and the goal is to smuggle a request to the backend server that accesses the admin panel and deletes the user Carlos. Open the lab and switch to burp proxy and there open the tab HTTP history and look for a request to the application. This one looks nice. Send it to burp repeater and switch to burp repeater. Delete the upgrade in secure request, connection, cookie, referrer, accept encoding, accept language, accept and user agent headers from the request and change the request method from get to post. Add the content links header with the value for and at the transfer encoding header with the value shunked. Hit enter twice, put in 6.0 and the second request with the request method post to the endpoint admin slash uh, space http slash 1.1 and at the content type header with the value application application slash x minus www minus form minus url encoded. The next header is the content length header content length with the value 15. Hit enter twice x equal 1 hit enter and now I put in a zero and now hit enter twice. One, two, and send this request to the application twice. One, two. You see in the response section, we received an HTTP 401 unauthorized response and scroll down in the response section and you see the message admin interface only available to local users. Back to the request section and at the host header with the value local host to the second request. Change the 60 to 71 and add the content type header from the second request to the first request. Okay, put paste in and now send the request twice. One, two. And you see in the response section, we received an HTTP 200 OK. That means we have access to the admin panel. Now, the goal is to delete the user Carlos. For that, we change the value 71 to 87. The request method from the second request is get and not post, get, and add the following to the URL sl admin slash delete question mark username equal Carlos. Okay. Now send the request to the application. Send. You see we received an HTTP 200 OK. That means we should delete the user Carlos. Here's the user Carlos. Refresh the browser window. Invalid request, yes. And normally we should delete this user. Okay. Homepage. Login. Homepage, okay. Maybe click on the back to lab description and open the lab again. Okay. That's a bit funny. Maybe we should send the request again. To okay. Refresh the browser window. Yeah. Back. Oh. Okay. <laughs> Access the lab again. In the request, yes, we know. Ah, uh, okay. <laughs> we solved the lab.